Hi guys, good morning or afternoon, whatever time you are watching this video of me reading another story to you. Um, this book is called Cookie Count, a tasty pop-up by Robert Sabuda. So I would like you to make a guess with Cookie Count. What kind of a book do you think this is? I'm going to make a prediction that this book is a counting book because it says cookie count. And I wonder if they might be tasting cookies. So if I open this book up, it does not make one whole page. Let me back up a little bit. This might work a little bit better. So cookie count, a tasty pop-up by Robert Sabuda. And I might just be able to read this one and let you see it while I read it. Not sure though. So it's really cool because it's a pop-up book. One chocolate chip cookie left unaware. I see a little mouse right here. And I think he is going to steal that cookie. Two coconut kisses to share. Hmm. We had number one on the first page, one cookie. Then we had two cookies. How many cookies do you think are coming next? One cookie, two cookies. Did you guess three cookies? Look at this cool page. Three twirling pinwheels to munch. Look at that. I don't think I've ever had a pinwheel cookie. Have you ever had a pinwheel cookie? So we had one. Then we had two. Then we had three. So one, two, three. What number do you think is coming next? Did you guess four? Four peanut butter cookies that crunch. So let's see. One, two, three, four. <coughs> Did you guess five? Five fortune cookies wrapped tight. Have you ever had a fortune cookie if you've gone out to a um, Chinese restaurant. They have little notes inside of them. This one says, sweet things often turn sour. Oh, that's not a very nice message. Avoid cat naps. Beware of those wearing whiskers. Nine lives are in store for you and soft paws hide pointy ears. I wonder if those all might be about the cat that this little these little mice are trying to avoid. Oh, hold on. I messed it up. So, one, two, three, four, five. Did you guess six? Six stained glass cookies, so bright. Look at how pretty those cookies are. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's see. Did you guess seven? Seven Linzer Hearts Divine. Those look delicious too. Oh, some, some little mouse took a chunk out of that one. I think that was the one he was nibbling on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What's your guess? Did you guess eight? Eight sugar cookies that shine. Oh, look, they have little glittery things on them. Those look good, too. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight. Did you guess nine? Nine Madelines fit for a king. Look at that. Pops right up there. I don't know if I've ever had a Madeline cookie. Have you ever had a Madeline cookie? I don't know. All right, let's see. We're getting to the end. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Did you guess 10? <gasps> 10 gingerbread windows for hiding. Can you see? I see some little mice hiding. Let's see from this side. I do see some mice hiding in there. Can you see them? They're so cute. So we had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different cookies. And we've talked about the number ten. You have ten fingers. You have 10 toes, and if you're counting, you can always use those fingers to find the number 10. So what I would like you to do today is I would like you to draw me a picture of your favorite kind of cookie. It could be chocolate chip. It could be one with sprinkles on it. It could be peanut butter cookie. It could be a fancy cookie like some of the ones in this book. Like a fortune cookie, it could be these stained glass cookies, it could be those Linzer heart, whatever your favorite cookie is, I would like you to draw it. And I would like you to have mommy and daddy or uh, Mamie or Grammy or Yaya or whoever you're with send me a picture on email so that I can see all of the wonderful cookies that you make, that you draw for me. And if you have this stuff at home and you wanna make real cookies, but moms and dads and yayas and grammys might be really busy. So it's okay if you don't make cookies today. Just draw one on a picture on a piece of paper and that'll be awesome. All right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow.